Today's workout will strengthen all the muscles of the core and help you reset and realign. We will do 16 exercises. Each exercise will be repeated six times. Let's get started. Lie down on your back with your legs bent. Your belly button is drawing in, your core is braced. Place your hands around your pelvis for pelvic tilts. Tilt the pelvis forward and press weight into the tailbone. Tilt the pelvis back and lengthen the low back. Inhale, tilt forward. Exhale, tilt back. Four more times. This exercise warms up the lumbar spine and activates the core. For pelvic clocks, imagine there is a clock on your low belly. 12 lines up with your belly button and 6 o'clock with the pubic bone. 9 is on the right, 3 on the left. Arch your pelvis and point to 6 o'clock. Now tilt to 9 o'clock, tilt backwards to 12 o'clock, tilt to the left to 3 o'clock. Come back to 6 o'clock. Reverse. 3, 12, 9, 6. The other way again. 9, 12, 3, 6. Reverse again. 3, 12, 9, 6. One more time in each direction. For toe taps, lift and extend, press your palms into the mat and keep your spine in neutral. Float the right leg to tabletop, extend at 45 degrees, draw back to tabletop, lower back down to the mat. Inhale, draw the left leg to tabletop, exhale, extend, inhale, draw back, exhale, lower to the mat. Two more times on each side. This exercise strengthens the abdominals and increases lumbopelvic stability. For toe taps, single leg, float both legs to tabletop and draw your ribcage in. Now lower the right leg towards the mat, return to tabletop. Inhale, lower the left leg towards the mat, exhale, return. Only lower as far as you can, keeping your spine in neutral. If your low back arches, you went too far. One more time on each side. Let's repeat with both feet flexed. Lower the right towards the mat, return to tabletop. Inhale, lower the left, exhale, return. Inhale, right again, exhale, return. Three more times. This exercise is great for strengthening the lower abs. Point your feet again and press your legs together. Slowly lower both legs towards the mat. Return to tabletop. Inhale and lower. Exhale, return to tabletop. Four more times. Keep your range small. Engage your core and draw your ribcage in.
Lower your feet down to the mat and take a few deep breaths. For the half curl, lengthen the spine and hover the arms slightly off the mat. Curl the head and shoulders off the mat. Reverse the articulation and lower the arms. Inhale, hover the arms. Exhale, curl up. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lower the arms. Repeat, inhale, hover. Exhale, curl up. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lower the arms. Three more times. This exercise strengthens the abdominals in flexion. Float both legs up to tabletop and let's repeat. Float the arms off the mat, curl up, reverse the articulation, lower the arms. Inhale, hover the arms, exhale, curl up. Inhale, lower down, exhale, lower the arms. Four more times. This is a great progression to the previous exercise and challenges your lumbar pelvic stability. Lower the feet to the mat. For the teaser, float both arms to 90 degrees, palms facing each other. Reach the arms forward, articulate through the spine and balance on your sits bones. Reverse the articulation and return the arms to start position. Exhale, roll up. Inhale, hold. Exhale, roll down. Inhale, return to start position. Four more times. Articulate through the spine as you roll up and try not to use momentum. Float both legs to tabletop and let's repeat. Reach the arms forward, articulate through the spine, balance on the sits bones. Reverse the articulation and return the arms to start position. Exhale, roll up. Inhale, hold. Exhale, roll down. Inhale, return to start position. Four more times. If this progression is too advanced, keep your feet on the mat. Lower the feet to the mat and extend your legs feet flexed for the roller. Knot the chin towards the chest, articulate through the spine and reach forward. Sit up straight, roll down one vertebrae at a time and return to start position. Exhale, roll up. Inhale, sit up straight. Exhale, roll down. Inhale to prepare. Exhale, roll up. Inhale, sit up straight. Exhale, roll down. Three more times. This exercise strengthens the abdominals through the entire flexion range and mobilizes the spine. Turn your body around and come to all fours.
Your hands are in line with your shoulders. Your spine is in neutral. For serratus push-ups, lower the chest and draw the shoulder blades closer. Now lift the chest and find space between the shoulder blades. Lower the chest, lift the chest. Inhale lower, exhale lift. Three more times. Keep your elbows relatively straight without locking them. This exercise strengthens the serratus anterior around the ribcage. For push-ups, move your hands forward, slightly tuck the pelvis and come into a kneeling plank. Bend the elbows, lower the chest and lift back up. Inhale lower, exhale lift up. Four more times. Line your hands up again with your shoulders for bird dog. Extend the right arm and left leg on the mat. Lift the arm and leg off the mat. Return to starting position. Extend the left arm and right leg on the mat. Lift them off the mat. Return to starting position. Move fluidly from side to side. Three more times. This exercise strengthens the obliques as well as the low back. Come back to all fours and find your neutral pelvis. Extend the right leg behind you and flex your foot. Maintain the height of your knee and bend your leg. Extend and bend your leg. Inhale, extend, exhale and bend. Three more times on this side. Lower the right leg to the mat. Extend the left leg behind you, flex your foot, maintain the height of your knee and bend your leg. Extend your leg and bend your leg. Inhale, extend, exhale and bend. Three more times. Lower the left leg back down to the mat. For knee hoppers, tuck your toes under. Hover your knees above the mat. Tap your knees on the mat. Hover again. Tap again. Hover. Tap. Hover. Tap. Hover. Tap. Last time, hover. Lower back down to the mat. Tuck your toes under again. And pike up into down dog. Stretch your hamstrings. Walk your hands back, release your knees, and come into Ragdoll. Release any tension. Slowly roll up, one vertebrae at a time. Great job. See you next time.